I want you to consider this. Many of the fears we have about artificial intelligence are absolutely terrifying. It's going to put people out of work. It's going to cause self-driving cars to run us over. It's, it's going to eradicate its human masters. So it's no surprise that it's becoming a major talking point here in the information profession, just as it is everywhere else. And that's okay, because there's definitely something to be worried about. However, that something probably isn't what you think it is. I'm Steve Weissman, the InfoGov guy, and I'll tell you what it is in just a second. We hear a lot about AI here in the world of information, and in my opinion, every minute we spend talking about it is a minute wasted. One that we should have spent talking about the whys and wherefores of the things that we're trying to do. Why? Because literally everything that gets interpreted as AI in our context today is actually machine learning. And once you come to terms with that, the rest of it simply drops out of the equation and leaves time for more productive endeavors. Think about it. One of the most compelling information applications I can think of is auto classification, which sure does look like artificial intelligence when it's set up correctly. But the fact is that it's really nothing but an amazingly effective manifestation of machine learning. As it's fundamentally based on rules and pattern matching and can fine tune itself over time. Now I say this like machine learning is some kind of weaker sibling to AI, so let me be clear, it isn't. It is different though, in a way that I broadly describe as being self-learning versus AI's self-teaching. I know I'll get mail about putting it that way, and <laughs> that's fine. In fact, I hope you do leave comments telling me I'm wrong, or better still, violently agreeing with me. Just as long as we don't lose sight of the greater point I'm trying to make, which is that the thing to be worried about when it comes to AI and information isn't the AI itself, but rather the time we spend worrying about its long-term effects on the human condition. There's no doubt in my mind that we as a society need to consider the moral and ethical issues that exist at the cutting edge of technology. But in our corner of the world, there is no reason to agonize over them because they simply don't manifest when it comes to doing what we do. We just want to find information when we need it, leverage it and protect it, and secure and assure it. From where I sit, AI is not now playing a role in this, and it may never do. So the thing we really need to be worried about is the time we lose worrying about it. That and the risk of <laughs> self-driving cars. This has been Consider This with Steve Weisman, the InfoGov Guy, a Hollywood production.